welcome back Thrill Seekers. Seekers. <laughs> um, apologies in advance for all the snoring in the background. It's my dogs. I have three of them and they're all going for it right now. Um, this is a replication of an experiment from uh, Warrant or Whoopi, as many of you may know him. Uh, love his channel. Make sure you check it out. Make sure you subscribe to, I think it's Whoopi Jump. Um, and uh, I've got some follow-up photographs for this video of the cotton thread close-up of when it's uh, unto and when it's you know stable like this now, and actually when it's spinning as well, so we can get some bit of detail on that. So let me just put that. So what we're going to see here, we're looking for an equal but opposite reaction. Um, I don't think I'm seeing it. Anyway, have a look. So I'll take this magnet, uh, incidentally, this way is north and that way is south. So that's a south pole, that's a north pole magnet. I do one half turn. What the hell? What's going on there? And this, what's actually happening to the twine in this situation, I've taken some, some macro shots of it, is the twine is actually twisting itself up. It's not like it's unwinding at the moment. It's actually twisting itself up and it'll get to a point where it can't turn any further and then it will unwind itself. But right now it's winding. It's basically, I would have thought, um, it's got a load, essentially, because it's winding a string. Anyway, very interesting. But it will, it will keep going until um, the string itself uh, has to unwind. Yeah, I don't understand that. Anyway, I'm in the southern hemisphere. And you can see which way it's rotating. 